Crawthorn, and this is the report. So, Thanksgiving is coming up, and, you know, time for people to come together with their friends and family, and be thankful for what they have, and, you know, how everything is going. It's a great uh, holiday to have. See people you normally don't see uh, often. Sometimes you see people who you do see fairly often. It really depends, I guess, on the situation of where you live and who all you're in contact with, with your family, close friends, and all that. You know, in a lot of ways, many holidays are sort of about that. Though, you know, this one is supposed to be also about being thankful. I think Thanksgiving is unique in that way. You know, people usually don't show or you know, think about their what they're thankful for for Thanksgiving, or like for like for instance Christmas. It's, you know, that happens on Thanksgiving, but you know, you don't really think about how thankful you are for everything Christmas these days. That's you know reserved for presents and who got me what and I gotta get somebody something and in many ways that's a bit of a hassle but and then again that's if you do celebrate the holiday Thanksgiving is a very good holiday in my opinion but it's one that's often forgot a holiday that people seem to forget uh, happens until it's almost there. You know, between Halloween and Christmas, there's anymore, there's like this void of nothing going on, even though there is a holiday in November, but, you know, people they don't seem to recognize it initially unless you know they're big they really enjoy thanksgiving then of course they'll know but if somebody's like they like thanksgiving you know even if it's for the you know four day weekend you know most many people get that some don't but you know you know a lot of people do have the days off on thanksgiving and friday and of course the weekend generally so from that, you know, people get excited about, and sometimes you know might get excited also about the uh, their family, seeing their family, perhaps even invited some friends who are like family, you know, to them, having a good time. But you know, I think it's a bit sad that in a way Thanksgiving here in America seems to be a bit forgotten. But I haven't forgotten. Uh, perhaps you haven't either. But regardless, uh, it's good to be thankful for what you have. You know, if you don't have a whole lot, you know, there are people who are less fortunate than you. Um, even if perhaps you yourself may be a little less fortunate than some others, but, you know, hey, that's nothing to be ashamed of, you know, be thankful for what you have, you know, if you're healthy, be thankful for that, um, there's many things to be thankful for, you know, it really depends on person to person, not everything is really all dreary and terrible, things can be very good, you know, and in many ways, things are good because we make them good make a situation that is generally not that great, make it, you know, better. Sometimes that is hard to do, but, you know, it can be achievable. Honestly, this time of year isn't all that bad. Sure, it can be cold, because, you know, weather and all, but, you know, winter is approaching, so it can be cold. There are people who don't like the cold. There are people who like the cold. There are people who are indifferent. 
but you know hopefully being around family friends that can make everything better or at least most things hopefully and all I really want to say is if anything is seems to be going wrong in your life just remember things can get better just keep that in mind and make sure everything will be all right in the end. And all honestly, I uh, <laughs> I enjoy this time of year. It's fun to see family and friends, but you know, it is a specific holiday where you do reflect and think about what all you have and what all you may get in the future not necessarily in you know monetary or you know material things but you know more important things just things that will sort of transcend all that if that makes any sense in all honesty uh, the holidays can be very fun very good I know some people do get depressed and saddened this time of year Hopefully, you'll find something that is uh, quite good and is actually, you know, worth being happy about. Again, everyone's different. Everyone's situation is different. Some people are more fortunate. Some people are less fortunate in various areas of things. But hopefully, you will be able to find some sort of comfort and enjoyment and happiness this time of year uh, you know Christmas is also next month uh, there's also Hanukkah you know, so one thing about Christmas that is a bit disappointing is you know the central core of you know family and friends coming together and Jesus's birthday and all that stuff it doesn't seem to be you know that doesn't seem to be the case anymore you know the last part at least you know the whole point of Christmas is to celebrate Jesus's birthday and to come together as you know as a family and you know, perhaps even friends and just enjoying spending time with one another in a way, which is what sort of like Thanksgiving is like here in America. And I believe Canada is similar, though that takes place before um, America's Thanksgiving. But, yeah. Well, it's unfortunate what has happened with Christmas, you know, when people in a lot of ways just seem to only care about the presents and that's it and then nothing too much more beyond that I, that's unfortunate I think but at least with Thanksgiving come together family and friends and just enjoy uh, everything being thankful for what you have and be thankful for you know that even if things aren't very good, they can always get better. And be thankful for that. Things can always get better. That's important. I think that's an important message to uh, send out this time of year. Wherever you are in the world. It doesn't necessarily have to be America. You know, the holiday where, you know, being thankful and all that is around the corner. It is important, I think, to uh, just uh, know that not everything is dreary. Not everything is bad. No matter what your situation is in the world, you know, keep up hope and stay optimistic. That's really all I can offer. Uh, but until next time, stay safe. Keep calm. 
The world we live in is a bit odd at times, but you know, that happens. For better or for worse. I'm Colin Ford. Thank you for watching.